Thank you uh, all for, for coming and covering this important issue. And this is just an impressive cross-section of members of both the House and Senate who are making this a priority. And we're excited about that, obviously grateful to Ivanka because she's really made it a priority for the White House, who, without whom this would not be at where it is today in terms of our discourse. I remember uh, when Mike Lee and I first started talking about this on the Senate side a couple of years ago, there were still some people that were very kind of um, lukewarm about the concept of doing this because everyone was focused on the growth side of tax reform. And by the way, so are we. So we believe growing the economy helps these working families with not just more jobs, but jobs that pay more. But we have to specifically target some assistance to them as well in the tax code because the most important institution in all of society is the family. And the most important job that any of us will ever do is to raise children and be parents. I don't care what title you have or what organization you run, the most influential and important job you will ever have is the raising of your children. And, um, and we know that today, from an economic standpoint, it costs more money than ever to raise a child. Mike Lee and others will get into the specifics, but one number that's staggering to me is the Department of Agriculture estimates that between the time a child is born and they're 18, you're going to spend about $230,000 per child in all the costs associated with it, from caring for them during the day to feeding, clothing, and everything else. And then when they turn 18, it gets even more expensive, and that's another topic for another day. But this is designed to say that we're going to have a tax code that's pro-family. We're going to grow our economy. We're going to help America become globally competitive. But we are going to help working families in the 21st century. And they are the only group in this debate that does not have a professional core of lobbyists that are fighting in the back halls to make sure that they are accounted for in the tax code. That's going to be our job, and we will get that job done. And so, again, I want to thank Ivanka and the White House and Senator Lee and Scott on the Senate side and these incredible House members as well, um, and Senator Capito, everybody, for the work that they're doing and being real champions of this. I, I, I'm optimistic that we will get this done, and I know that it will make our tax reform better for it. So thank you all for covering it.